Yo, what's y'all boys? Hope you guys are doing good. And my ladies. Not just, you know what I'm saying? My bad. But today, I really want to talk about how the universe and God will guide you on your purpose, right? So, you know, in life, when you find your purpose, you might be doing something else. And you might be scared to take the risk of even starting your purpose. But you got to remember, God and the universe is on your side. It is on your side because this is your purpose. So why wouldn't God and the universe guide you on your purpose? Why wouldn't it give you the upper hand? Why wouldn't it have you have unexpected things happen to you that are good that you thought that couldn't happen? Why would it not? If it's your purpose, if you feel it in your soul, you know, that's what you want. You desire this. This is in your soul. This is what God has put you here to do. The universe and him will assist you. It will assist you. All you got to do is just continue to keep going. You can't give up. You got to continue to keep on striving because it's your purpose, right? All right? There's going to be bumps in the road when you're going through your purpose, but you have to remember, they are here to guide you. The universe and God is here to guide you. You have almonds, right? Almonds are basically signs that are telling you What's going to happen? What are you doing? So basically, almonds are like butterflies. Almonds are like, what's another one? There's butterflies. There's caterpillars. Not caterpillars. Yeah, yeah. No, no, not caterpillars. Butterflies are slugs, um, ladybugs. Things in this world and the universe are almonds, right? So the universe is in front of you. So when you're going for your purpose and you're out in the universe, you can see that. Say if a butterfly, say if you know you're on your purpose and you know you're doing your thing and you know that you're doing well in your thing and you're just continuing to keep going, right? Even if you're not doing well, even if you're just doing it, but you know it's you, right? And you see a butterfly, a ladybug, all these insects and different things out in public, that is an almond, that is a sign because a butterfly was once in a cocoon and then it sprouted out into this beautiful thing. That's what's happening with you. You're transforming. That's why you have to pay attention to your surroundings. You have to pay attention to the universe. You have to pay attention to everything because it's a language. It gives you what's going to happen. It tells you right in front of you. Everything is right in front of you. Everything is. There's signs everywhere. Signs when you go out. Even when signs, random people just come up to you and just be like, oh, I love your energy. I love this. I love that. That's a sign that you're on the right track, that you're going to the right place, that your energy is right. And that you are right. That you have to keep going. You have to read those almonds. You have to read those signs. Look at the insects. Look up what they mean when you continue to see them a lot. I got for instance when I was just talking about butterflies. You feel me? Slugs. Slugs also mean, right, slow and steady. And that you're on a slow progression, but it's definite. That you're going to get there. Because that's what slugs do. If you see about the slugs in the hare and the snail, that story where they're racing, slow and steady wins the race, right? It's basically what it is about the slugs. If that comes on you, because I had a slug literally come on me. And I'm like, what does this mean? So I looked it up and I found out what it meant. And that's the almond, right? Because what, what are the chances of a slug getting on you? Like on my finger, right? So things in those natures, in the nature are literal almonds. And as you see, keep continue to see things, look up those things. Look up those things, what they mean, right? And, and study your almonds and study what those things mean and study why you keep seeing them so much because the universe talks. It talks to you. If you're on your purpose, don't be afraid. If you're on your purpose, don't be afraid. Continue to keep going. Don't go back to that old you. I was doing what was not your purpose just because you want to feel safe. Don't go back because there's no reason to. The new you wants you to go. The universe wants you to go. God wants you to go. They're going to assist you while you're on your go, while you're going. So don't be like, oh, I'm scared. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. If you feel in your heart and your soul that this is your purpose, go ahead. This is your, this is your purpose. This is for you. No, for, no, this is for you. Keep going. It's going to happen.
There's no reason to be scared. Let the universe, God, do his thing. And you just continue to work. And you continue to love yourself. And you continue to cherish yourself. And you continue to study your almonds. Almonds, omens. You study those things. You read about the law of attraction. You read about things. You read your Bible. You do those things, right? So you understand and you know, okay, if this is coming here, I know what this means. I know I'm on the right track. I know this almonds mean that. And there's also bad almonds, omens, right? So you have to read these signs, read what's going on. Just read the universe because it's in front of you. And your purpose is for you. Everything is for you when you're doing that, right? When you when you when you want to go do some chase your dreams, when you want to be an entrepreneur, when you want to take a big risk to level up your life, it is for you. It's in your favor at that point because the universe knows. Okay, this is his purpose. This is his basically his personal legend. This is this is their purpose. So I'm going to assist you in weird ways. Have you ever had a way where you're going for something, right? You're like, oh, I don't know how this is going to get done or this is going to get done. And it gets done. That because God and the universe is working in your favor for you to continue to do what you're doing. You have to see that. So once you see that and you understand that. You won't feel as uneasy about what you're doing. You will feel more confident in yourself. And your abilities to keep going. And you're going to love yourself and love your journey. And you'll be like, wow, this is crazy. Like the universe, you're going to be more in touch with it. Because a lot of people are out of touch. A lot of people see things in the universe. Oh, it's just a coincidence. Oh, it's just this. Oh, it's just that. They're not open. So they're not open. They're not going to see it. And so they're just going to miss their opportunity. And what? Their purpose, their real purpose or personal legend is going to die. It's going to die. And they're never, ever going to be able to do it. So you have to see it, believe it, and go at it and continue to imagine yourself doing what you're doing at a high level and making it. Because that's the real reason we're all here for our personal legend, for our purpose, and to be bigger than what we see in the mirror and to be something in this world and to provide value to the world and value to our families, value to ourselves and love ourselves and create. Because there's nothing really else to do at the end of the day. Right? Anyways, hey guys. I appreciate y'all boys. Y'all boys be safe. And women be safe. Out here. It is hot. It is August. Be safe.